Yeah, LinkedIn, we linked in, man. And today we back with another video. Make sure if y'all new to the channel, y'all hit that subscribe button, y'all drop a comment and hit that like button, man. We got a big update in this BTB Savage situation. I'm gonna let y'all see this clip I put together and I'm gonna check in with y'all at the end of this clip and let y'all know an update, y'all. Expected the death of a rapper from San Antonio killed in the Galleria area here in Houston. The suspect is not in custody tonight. Houston police announced that 40-year-old Montrell Leonard Burley is now charged with Gentry's murder. And there's a warrant out for his arrest. I've never seen that man a day in my life. Both Ward and Houston police have pointed to retaliation as a motive in Gentry's killing. The mom told me today she is still devastated, but she feels very grateful that the Houston Police Department has been able to name a suspect. Her son, of course, died right here about eight days ago, and since then, the family's life has been torn apart. My son knew something was up. That's why he was trying to leave. When my son pulled out, he was headed to the airport to come to me because I tell him, get the hell out of there. Leave right now. Don't take no clothes. Don't take nothing. Just leave. You know? And he was leaving. And that's when they ended. But he never made it to the airport because they killed him. Ward says she was worried when her son posted on social media about allegedly killing a would-be robber in self-defense. It's unclear how Burley fits into that scenario. But Ward believes he won't be the only suspect when the investigation is complete. They did tell me they have a list, uh, a list of suspects um, that they are going to be rounding up um, for the murder of my son. If you know the whereabouts of Burley, please call Houston Police. Yeah, as y'all can see, man, this guy, Mr. Burley, has taken the time out of his busy schedule to shoot a music video in the midst of him being wanted for a murder, a very high profile murder at that. So Mr. Burley was so nice enough to give us an insight and let us hear some of his music and check out his visuals and what he actually does. <laughs> no, let me stop trolling, but no, man, yeah, this dude, and I don't know what's up, this is the same thing that happened in the Young Dog case, man. This dude dropped the video in the midst of being on the run and everything like that. I don't understand how they think a music video is going to help their case in their situation, which is trying to kind of crazy to me. But, um, yeah, man, he on the run and he dropped a whole music video. It's a lot of more stuff going on, but, like, I ain't trying to get a little too, too policey. But, yeah, this guy's from San Antonio. Um, he signed with, like, some major dudes that down, got their little own independent label down in San Antonio. And uh, I don't know. I guess after they, they rewarded him with a music video after he uh, got some get back for the gang, I guess. But, uh, yeah, man, we linked in. Man, y'all hit that subscribe button, man. Y'all drop a comment. This is Mr. Burley right here, man. And they have a list of other suspects they are pursuing, man. So, it's going to be a lot of more news popping up, man. We linked in.